Hello and welcome to my race video for the Warwick Half Marathon. So this is my third race in my preparation for a goal of running as close as possible to 3 hours 15 at the Shakespeare Marathon, which is actually seven weeks today. Um, I've done the 10k and a 10 mile race already in preparation. So this is the first time hitting that half marathon distance. I've run this course four times before over my running years. Um, the latest being in 2020, about two weeks before our first lockdown. Um, again, that was in preparation for running Stratford, which was obviously cancelled. It's not overly flat, this route, so it's not a PB course, but it's a definitely a good test of leg strength and just to see where the fitness is, really, uh, what kind of pace I can maintain. It's a bit of a last minute entry for today. I had my eye on this race anyway, but the price did put me off a little bit. Um, my option was either to come here or go back to Draycott. They, they're holding a half marathon next weekend. Um, but they put out for this race, for Warwick, a 30% discount code. So on Wednesday night, I decided that um, I'd come back here. It's closer to home anyway. Looking forward to today, a little bit nervous. The goal for today will be, so if I'm doing a three hour 15 marathon, I'll be looking to split the half marathon in one hour 37 and 30 seconds. So I need to be under that today. If I'm not under that today, then there's no chance that I'm going sub 315 in seven weeks time. Uh, my PB on this course is one hour 32.30. So I'm hoping somewhere in the region of that, which will probably bring me out 135. So anything under 135, I'm absolutely more than happy with. So I need to go and get my number now. Uh, I'll be doing a warm up as well. short out and back one mile warm up um, you can probably hear that I've got my tempo next percent on the loudest shoe ever it's absolutely freezing today um, definitely keeping my leggings on and my jacket as well not the outer jacket but my yellow jacket underneath this is going to be the last one mile of the route so the next time I'm on this section is the home straight now uh, the finish is outside Warwick race course so normally like I said it would finish on the main road but they've uh, swooped us in on the last section taking us off the main road and we're finishing um, right outside on the actual race course itself just gonna head back to the car offload my coat uh, pick up a gel and then head off towards the start line
in the car now race is all complete really pleased with my time one hour 33 and 12 seconds which is only 40 seconds slower than my course pb from two years ago uh, really pleased with it and to be honest i didn't think it would go so well at all uh, i started the race and probably by about mile three and my legs were just dead i thought this is going to be a really tough race i was pleased with my pace at that moment but I thought I'm not going to be able to maintain this. Just kept going with it. Thought I'm just, I'll back off a little bit, and it felt like I was backing off. But then when I was looking at my watch, um, the splits were still going really well. Um, and then by about mile ten, I thought, you know what? Just keep pushing through this, and um, I'm not really going to lose any time. So what I perceived to be uh, quite a, a difficult first half of the race, um, time-wise, that didn't really show on anything too negative, really. And it didn't feel as hilly as I remembered it being. I know it's a hilly course, and if you look at the elevation um, chart of the route, you think that's going to be quite difficult. But the ups didn't really feel um, as bad as what the uh, graph shows. But I definitely appreciated the downs and was able to gain back and uh, build up a bit of the speed that I'd lost from the ups. So overall, really pleased. Um, still difficult. Half marathons are going to be hard. It felt comfortable hard and although I probably couldn't have gone much faster I didn't really feel uncomfortable doing it there was it's like there was still a little bit left in the tank which is um really good news but yeah that was my uh, race today Warwick half marathon I may book one more race in the next few weeks um I'm not sure what distance that's going to be um just see how I recover from this one maybe because I didn't feel like I was giving it a hundred percent today i may hopefully recover a little bit quicker than i have done from the last two races that i've done but yeah um thanks for watching today's video i'll uh give you an update on week number i think we're on week number nine training on wednesday um hope you enjoyed today's video i'm gonna drive home and get myself a nice shower and something to eat and then I'm off to work this afternoon, so definitely a busy Sunday for me. Thanks again for watching and catch you next time. Bye.